Well, hello, my YouTube family. Yes, it's been a minute. It's been a minute. But it's the end of the week for me. And, uh... Four days is always like five. But thank you, Jesus. We have tomorrow off. Veterans Day. Thank you, God. Uh, yeah. I'm just, I'm just grateful, thankful. But I still have things to do tomorrow. It ain't a relaxing Veterans Day for me. Although it could be, but I need to go out and put some air ah, in my tires. I have to put air on all, in all four of them. All four tires need air. So that's, that's one thing that has to be done. And while I'm out, I might as well go to the Dunkin' Donuts. Get me my frozen chocolate and my snack and bacon. I mean, why not? Why not? Damn it. My money just can't be made just to pay bills. Made just to pay bills. Made just to, I mean, come on. Can I have a little joy? Can I have a little joy? Because bills are not joy for me. I mean, they do keep the lights on and the heat and all of that i mean that's all well and good and bills you know to keep the computer going and all of this wonderful stuff but can i can i have some like real joy can i have some real joy and the snack and bacon is real joy for me as well as the frozen chocolate so um i mean i'm saying all of this now but come tomorrow i don't know what i'll do will i really want to get out of bed and go for the snack and bacon and the frozen chocolate Tune in tomorrow, but you won't see me tomorrow because uh, you, you know, <laughs> you just won't. So that is that. With that, upon that, let us do this. You cannot miss them. And this, pray to Jesus. I was going to do it tomorrow, but mm, I need I need a day for myself. Saturday will be here soon enough. So it'll be done on Saturday because I need rest. And even getting the hair done is not rest. Lips of the day, right? Okay. You can't miss them. It is the NARS Power Matte Lipstick. Oh, even though it doesn't look matte because I put a gloss on top because it really is a matte. So uh, I couldn't, you know, my, my lips were like shriveling up. So I needed some moisture. So it's kind of like a combo. It's kind of like a combo. This is in the shade Dragon Girl. Thank you, Taylor Swift. Okay, so I have a little mini. And this is what it looks like. This is Dragon Girl. And this is Dragon Girl. There you go. And the gloss is a Avon True Nourishing Lip Oil. But it's got little sparkles in it. The sparkles don't show because once you put it on top of a uh, of a lipstick, they're not really going to show all that much. So this is Dragon Girl. Matte as all matte can be. And put a little gloss on top and you got a little shiny Dragon Girl. Okay. Thank you, Taylor Swift. It's another one of hers. Uh, not hers as in hers, but you know what I mean one of her red lipsticks i said it yes i said it okay so it is the end of the week for me thank you god i have been pounding just to get here just to get here so i can max and relax and if you hear whining in the background it is the refrigerator struggling okay so <laughs> yeah okay well you know that is that with that upon that this is lips of the day cannot miss them and uh yeah yeah i left at 501 i think 502 501 or 502 and my boss was like nancy you're late 
It's 501. You should have been gone by now. You know what? I don't hear you saying anything when I come in at a quarter two. I don't hear you saying, oh, Nancy, you're early. I, I don't hear that, though. But when I want to leave at my regular time, because I am 9 to 5, and sometimes I do get there early, and sometimes not so much. For the most part, not so much. But every once in a while, I do get there early. How come you're not saying anything then when I get there early, though? How come you're not saying anything then? You know what? I won't see anybody tomorrow, Saturday and Sunday. Three glorious days. I always say, please let them not go so fast. Sweet Jesus in heaven, please don't let them go so fast. We all know. They go when they go. But right now, it is max and relax time. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? Did anybody see the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills last night. Um, so now Kyle is having issues in her marriage. But isn't it like a fake thing? Because, you know, there's a lot of, there's a lot of, there's a lot of push-pull here. Maurizio is on Dancing with the Stars. And of course, The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills has already been taped. People are talking to him about what is going on. And he's like, oh, no, nothing. We're all fine and all well and good. You watching The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. And Kyle is like, she's, she, she doesn't take pictures with her husband anymore. And Dorit has noticed that she's not even wearing her ring. And Dorit is the one that noticed everything. Like, you don't even take pictures with Maurizio anymore. Like, what's going on? And she's talking about, well, we've, we, we're having a couple of struggles. Are they, though, or is it just for storyline sake? Far be it for me to say anything. I don't know. This is what the word on the street is, though, that it's specifically for storyline purposes. Just word on the street. Far be it for me to say yay or nay. I'm just watching. You know, I got my little popcorn. I'm just watching. I am just a viewer just like everybody else. Okay, so I don't know what's going on. So there's that. What else is going on on uh, Beverly Hills? Um, oh, they all went to a, you know, like a Magic Mike kind of a show with the male strippers and all of that. And um, the Asian woman, I forget her name. She went up, she got pulled up on stage and she was having a good time and rubbing the chest and all of that. And she was having a good time. And um, who else? I think, I think, um, what is her name? The one I really like, the blonde one who just got a divorce from her, her rich husband. Y'all know the one I'm talking about. Uh, I really love her. But why do I keep forgetting her name? Um, her... She went up on stage. You know she was going on stage because uh, that is where she is comfortable. She knows what to do when she's on stage. And she knows, hunty, she went on the full, uh, those of you who have seen it, you know. And those of you who haven't, oops, I'm spilling the beans. Um, she went up on stage. She got on the floor, spread her legs, let the guys, oh, she was um, a bit much. But that's just, that's just her. Her name is not Vicky. Her name is not Veronica. What is her name? Y'all know who I'm talking about. Anyway, they all had a good time with the exception of, um, you know what? I'm tired of not knowing these women's names. Um, hold on. I, you know what? I have to, I have to look them up. I have to look them up because I'm tired of saying, you know, you know, you know. Y'all know who, the ones who I'm talking about who know, who watch the show, but you know, come on, come on, Nancy, get it together. Let's Google the names, shall we? Let's get it together. Hold the phone. I will be with you in a moment. Um, hold on. Here we go. Okay. What are their names? 
Um, okay, we have Crystal. We have Sutton. Sutton wants to be a cool chick, but on her own terms. That's not the way being a cool chick works. I'm sorry. That's really not the way. She wanted to be a cool chick with, um, what's her name? Give me a moment. Um, shoot. Um, not she wanted to be, she wanted to be a cool chick with Dorit, Kyle, and shoot, and Crystal, and what is? I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. What is her name? You know the one I'm talking about. You know the one I'm talking about. Hold on, let me get. I'm sorry. There's Erica. There's Sutton, Dorit, Crystal. Who's Anne Marie? Oh, that's a new wife. Anne Marie Wiley. I don't know her. Um, Garcelle. Wanted to be a cool chick with Garcelle and all. Because um, Sutton and Garcelle are really good friends, you know, outside of the show and everything like that. Garcelle was having herself a good time with the man and the, you know, touching their chest and all of that. And here goes Sutton. She was such a wet blanket. But you want to be cool with the cool chicks. They're not having sex in front of you. They're just having a good time. This is a Magic Mike show. What did you think was going to happen? Like, what did you think was going to happen? You were just going to all sit there like nuns and go, ooh, ah, yeah, they look so nice. Come on, Sutton. Come on, Sutton. Like, come on, Sutton. And you ain't got no man, but you, you worrying about you want a man. Once you get the man, what do you expect to do with the man? He ain't going to be taking you out to dinner once, twice, thrice and not expect anything in return. Boo-boo, come on. Life, that's how it works, Sutton. For a very rich woman, you you, you, you kind of, um, in the social skills, you're kind of lacking just a little bit. So, you know, she was kind of the wet blanket, but then, you know, they kind of... They had to, okay, Sutton, okay, Sutton, you know, nice, nice. You'll be okay. It's, it's really not that serious. You're not like you're having sex right there on the stage, even though uh, Erica, if she didn't wear those leather pants, she probably would have. I'm just saying. But even Sutton didn't even get on Erica's nerves. Erica said for Lent, <laughs> she said for Lent, I am not going to get upset. I am not going to get upset. I'm not going to let Sutton get me upset for Lent. I am not getting upset. So I was like, way to go, Erica. That is my girl. Love me some Erica. So, you know, that was the whole show. And of those of you who watched it, y'all know what I'm talking about. Those of you who didn't watch it, watch it. Even though I've just spilt the beans. But, you know, there's a whole bunch of other stuff in the show that I didn't talk about. So there's that. So that's just basically it in a nutshell. Um... Tomorrow is not just a stay-at-home day for me. Didn't I tell you this already? I spoke about this already, didn't I? People, I'm so tired. I don't know when I repeat myself. But yeah, I think I'm going to go out tomorrow for some snack and bacon. Anyway. Because I'm going to be going out anyway. So I might as well, you know, kill two birds with one stone and all of that. Alright, so that is basically it in a nutshell. This is Lips of the Day with my little mini NARS lipstick in the shade Dragon Girl. Thank you, Taylor Swift, because she wears this also. I think this is the last of the Taylor Swift lipsticks that I've got. And uh, I didn't wear a Taylor Swift lipstick yesterday, though. Nope. There's another one that I have yet to wear. It's called Celeb. I have to wear that one next week. Okay, so that is basically it in a nutshell, people. I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think. If anybody has, um, what is it again? Dragon Girl. The memory is the first to go when you get old, people. Um, if anybody has Dragon Girl, let me know how you like it. And 
I liked it a lot. Of course, I had to put a little gloss on top because of damn, this is a matte. It's an uber matte, a super matte, a uh, uh, ultra matte. It's matte, okay, to the point where you do need, uh, for me, anyway, I do need a little something, something. It doesn't change the color of the, of the lipstick. This is Dragon Girl. So that is basically it in a nutshell. Hopefully, the next time you see me, the hair will be done. Hopefully. Okay, if I'm not going tomorrow, I'm definitely going to go on Saturday. Hopefully. I mean, it needs to, it's, 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 it's time. It needs to be done. Okay, so there you have it. That is that with that upon that. I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up and let me know what you think. And I will talk to you next week sometime. Okay? I love you. I hope you all have a wonderful and safe Veterans Day. If you do have veterans in your family, celebrate them. You know, hopefully they are still alive. Celebrate them. Love them. Ask them to tell you stories. I mean, my father, I guess you can consider him a vet. He served in the Army. He tells me stories all the time about the Army. So, you know, sit and talk and have a little family get together and, you know, I'm sure they'd like to share their stories unless they had very painful ones. But the ones that aren't so painful, ask them to share with you. It'll bring you all a little closer. And you'll understand your parents or your grandparents a lot more. Okay? Just saying. And with that, I am bidding you all adieu. And this is Lips of the Day. Me lovey. Me lovey a whole hell of a lot. That's it in its, its non-glossed up form. That is Dragon Girl. And uh, that is that with that upon that. I love you and I will talk to you sometime next week. Okay? I love you. Mwah, mwah, mwah. See you next week. Bye now.